What's up, you guys? And welcome back to my channel. Oh, <laughs> I am so exhausted, not gonna lie. I spent the last three days now, including today, um, um, filming for a 22 days. I filmed, I wanted to film the first half and, like, have the first half already done to give myself a little bit of time to edit everything and then get it up for you guys. And then, um, I'll resume filming the rest of it, like, on, you know, December 12th. So, yeah. So, I'm gonna try to get the first I hope for you guys video every day. Today's the second, though. So, but the video, the first couple videos won't be coming out until Sunday. Saturday, well, between Saturday and Sunday-ish. Um, because Sunday's the 6th. And then, of course, you guys will see a video a day next week starting on the, uh, this is the seventh. I'm not sure. I, I don't know. Um, I think that's the seventh. Yeah. So seventh to eleventh, you guys will see that stuff. And while you guys are seeing that stuff, um, I'll be getting stuff together for the last half of Twenty Days of Art and making sure that like everything's up and you know just, we have fun. So I'm gonna try to do videos at the end of each week. Like I tried to do last year. Um, of course, I'm pretty sure something's probably still going to get lost. But that's okay. <laughs> um, so, I mean, it's not okay. But, I mean, it happens every some For some reason, my technology is just like, you're doing too much. And it's just like, okay, this is deleted, that's deleted, that's gone. And I'm just like, I said 22 videos, but now it's only like 19 because stuff got lost. Where did my stuff go? I don't know. So... Yeah, um, but if you notice, I mean, I, I was going to wear my black one like this, but I decided to just keep this one off. I just found another video for this. Hip-hop, because you know your girl loves Christmas hip-hop dance videos. Oh my gosh, so fun. Um, and I have white. I got this last year for my birthday. You guys, I think I showed you guys this. I'm not sure. But I only worn it twice. This is my Jack Skellington sweater that my twin, Dee Dee, got me. Thank you again, Dee Dee. I love it. It's sequined and beautiful and perfect and it's so fluffy. Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> so, of course, my kind of overalls. I don't want to do all black, so I just put this, I kept this on. That and I didn't want to change it because I wanted to hurry up and film this um, before it starts to get noisy, you know, upstairs. Um... Because everybody will be home soon. So, yeah. Um, but, this video is going to be really fun because I did a thing where I bought myself everything that, well, not everything, everything, but a lot of the things that I wanted for my birthday this year since there was a bunch of sales and I was just like on the female of the store because of. Stuff, you know, trying to close again and everything. So I was like, I'm gonna just give, my, give myself now that I want for myself. And so I love giving myself gifts. I mean, I love it. I don't know about you guys, but I love it <laughs> when I can. Um, it's nice to do stuff for yourself, you know? I don't think there's anything wrong with it. I don't think it's selfish or anything. Um, I do it all the time when I can. So. Treat, your, treat yourself. Why not? Um, so, yeah. I bought a bunch of cool things. One thing I have to unbox, the other things I kind of already unboxed because the only reason I unboxed the other ones or unpackaged, because they weren't in boxes, the other ones, well, I think one of them was in a box, but regardless, the reason why I unpackaged the other ones is because I got the from Hot Topic and there wasn't they didn't say Hot Topic's name on, I think, the first two or three of them. I'm just like, who are these from? So I had to open them. I'm like, oh, okay, but why is the name on here? Like, the package label didn't have the store name on there. I'm just like, why isn't the name on here? I don't know who this is from. So I had to open it to make sure I knew, like, what it was. It had my name on it, but I'm like, what? what is this? You know? So, yeah, I mean, I, I didn't take them out of the other packaging that they're currently in, so... 
I mean, I'm going to do that now. <laughs> and I have one thing that I bought. I'm not going to tell you what store it's from uh, yet. But you guys will see that. I'm going to wait till the end to open that beauty. Um, but something else I wanted because it was on sale. And I was just like, why not? It's not expensive. I'm going to get it. <laughs> so, because my other stuff was kind of expensive. Um, but, yeah, so... Okay, so the first thing I have, I completely took out of the packaging because it's clothing. And because of everything going on in the world right now, I always not buy clothes, like whether I'm ordering them or going to the store to get them. Um, I always wash them because you never know. Sometimes people return things or they touched it and they're like, oh, this is too small. I'm not, I'm not going to wear this anymore like I thought I was and they just send it back. So I just want to make sure that everything's sanitary and everything, so... Uh, I washed it. <laughs> Fun fact, didn't try this on, but I'm pretty sure it fits because I have to get an extra small and, or extra, between extra small and medium, everything on a topic because their clothes are way too big for me usually. They're meant for people that are taller than I am and, uh, wider than I am. I'm too thick. So, um, I always have to, I, and then suspender skirts, Specifically, I have to get a, or suspenders in general, I have to get a small. This is actually like, this is a large or a medium or something, but it's too big. So I have to make extra holes in the, the straps just so that it'll fit me. Still a little too big, but at least it fits me to where I don't have to wear all my clothes falling down, you know? It's embarrassing. So, <laughs> I got, I wanted their Coraline collection. If you guys don't know, I love Coraline. Oh, I have the movie. I watch the movie all the time. The movie is probably tired of me watching it at this point. But I love Coraline. I love, like, when I first, when I first saw the trailer for it, I was in middle school. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, I was in middle school when the trailer came out. I was so excited, but never got to go see it in the theater. I watched it on demand, knowing that I would just love it. I absolutely loved it. And it's one of those movies that, for me, I can watch it all the time and never get tired of it. Like in the for Christmas. <laughs> I mean, obviously, I'm wearing the sweater right now. Like, But I remember I posted on one of their things they put on Instagram. I was like, can you guys do some more pieces for the Coraline collection? So I guess they answered me and were like, yeah. So there's a bunch of stuff now. Um, so if you guys want some Coraline merch, then go get you some merch. On their website. Definitely got mine before it sold out. I think this was like, I paid 28 for it. But I think it was like 30 or 40 something originally. But this is the Coraline suspender skirt. They have another skirt that's like a corduroy. Um, I liked it, but I was just like, eh. I like the suspender skirts. I like suspenders in general right now, so I'm like a suspender nut. <laughs> and this is the um, Faces of the Moon, but it's Coraline inspired, so of course it has Coraline on it, right there, the iconic um, shadow, or silhouette, and the phases of the moon, but as told by Coraline. In buttons, which I thought was so adorable, I was like, oh my god, that's so cute. And it has her name, of course, on the inside of it. I got extra small, like I said, because... Suspenders are way too big for me. The suspenders I wore for my Boogie Boogie video that I did, well, both of the videos I did, um, I had to get extra small on those to make sure that they fit and they're perfect. Um, this, extra small, because it just looked like it was going to be too big for me. I still haven't tried it on, though, so I should probably do that. <laughs> uh, thankfully, I don't throw away tags until I know something fits, so... I mean, I throw away one of the tags, but the other one I can't, so... Um, I love this. It's very, I like the fabric. It's very soft, and it's very, like, pleated. I love pleated skirts. So, I love the little buttons on the front. I love these, how shiny they are. They're, like, really well-made buttons. Those are so cute. Um, <coughs> sorry. So, this next thing I got was these bracelets, which I'm going to open. There's a core line bracelets. Show you that up there. So we got the button key here for the door. And this purple one has a plate on it that says Coraline on it. 
And this one, at the bottom, this orange one, has a dragonfly, which I actually got another piece to match it. I'm going to show you guys that in a second. Um, actually, where is it? I just had it. Oh, here it is. So, the piece I got to match it was this dragonfly necklace. And on the, like, up underneath it, in the box, it says, Coraline, curious, brave, explorer, resourceful, intelligent. All the things that she is. I mean, she's just goals. <laughs> I love her. So, yeah, I love it. At first, I wasn't going to get this, because I didn't like the Dragonfly bracelet at first, but I was like, I'm going to get the bracelet. I might as well buy the, ne buy the necklace to match it, so... That's going to be cute. Um, and I got some other little things that I want to I'm really excited about these. So these, since I'm into scrunchies at the moment, um, these are Coraline scrunchies. I actually was looking for another set like this um, from the collection. Because I bought this one. I was like, wait, what if I want to do two ponytails and I want one of each? Um, I forgot to buy second set when I bought these ones and when I went to go get them they were sold out so I had to wait for them to restock if they restock to get more. Oh they smell brand new too I love that. Um this orange one has like little buttons you can see they have little buttons all over it. This one's just a plain velvet yellow. I love velvet. Oh my god. And satin. Um and then this one has a little stars like her sweatshirt that she wears in the later parts of the movie. And it says Coraline on it. Let's see if I can pull it so you guys can see her name, but it says Coraline on it. Little focus. <laughs> it says Coraline on it. They're really cute. And I love the packaging. Adorable. I love that. Classic Coraline. And I got one more thing from that line. That I really wanted. I mean, there's a couple other things I really wanted, but they were a little bit more on the expensive side, and I'll just like wait till my birthday and get those. So I might do some ordering for my actual birthday. So, um, but I got, I've been looking at this for a while now. I got this cute, because I love the little, I guess they call them passport bags. I love this little Coraline passport bag. It's so Adorable. Look how cute. That's from Loungefly, by the way. Adorable. I wish the straps had, like, some cool design on it, but, I mean, plain black is always fine by me. I love black. I mean, obviously. So, and then, of course, here's a little tag. I love the fact that the little tags have her face on them. How cute. Um, and then, of course, it says Hot Topic on it. You guys know my favorite store. Oh, my God. Um, and then look at the back. I love the stitching. So cool. Look at that. And that has the cat on there at the bottom. Adorable. And the little, one of the little jumping mice, or jumping rats, as I like to call them. Um, but it's adorable. It's so cute. I can't wait to wear this. Oh my gosh. It's going to be cute for like going to events and stuff, which is going out with my friends. This outfit I actually bought for, to do, since I can't do what I want to do for my action, for my birthday this year, to do a celebration for, well, for my birthday, and I always do something on my actual birthday, but my actual birthday I just hang out with my, you know, fiancé Isaiah, and we, you know, spend the whole day together, but the other day is for just for me and my friends, and we just go out and we have a good time. Um, so since we can't do that, since that's canceled this year, I'm going to do... A, I'm going to do something with everybody on my actual birthday this year, but then um, next year I'm going to do something for my half birthday and my actual birthday. So for my half birthday, we're going to do something, I don't know what yet, I'm going to wear my Coraline skirt, I decided to save it, so I'm going to save it until then to wear it. And then, um, I'm going to do something for my actual birthday, which would hopefully be medieval times, which is what I want to do this year, but can't, because, you know, the Rona. So, yeah. But, 
next time is always next year. Hopefully it's will be better next year. I'm, I'm hoping, fingers crossed, that everything will be better and it'll be fine and like, maybe not perfect, but at least somewhere back to normal. You know? A little can dream. More than anything, more than anything I could ever materialistically get for my birthday, that's what I want this year. Is to have a great 25th year, the pandemic to be controlled, and everything to be, you know, somewhere that's normal, where everybody gets back to their normal lives and everything. Because um, I think what we all need that right now. So, more than anything else I can materialistically get for my birthday, that's all I want for my birthday, is to just have a great 25th year, be able to travel again, hang with my friends, hug my friends, like, just be able to, you know, enjoy life again, like I want to. Um... Anyway, <laughs> um, the next thing I'm going to do is open my last thing I bought for you guys. So, let's go. So guys, here's the box. And it's kind of big. Now, we're going to open it. Okay, so before I show you guys what's inside this beautiful box, um, I love Bow Bear. I have a quite, well, I wouldn't say quite a few. I only have four Bow Bears, because I have Light Fury, um, my Werewolf, my Songbird Serenade Pony that I made. I have another one. I just can't remember which one it is. Oh, I thought I had another one. I can't remember. Um, <laughs> I have so many stuffed animals, it's hard to remember all of them sometimes. Uh, but, um, what was I going to say? So, I went, I was on Instagram, which is how I usually find a lot of the stuff that I end up buying. And I saw that they were having like an online, they were having a no-line online sale. So, um, and they have like a couple like little things. On sale, I was like, eh, I'm not really sure if I want any of these other ones. But the gingerbread, um, the gingerbread cookie plushes that they had stood out to me. They were like six bucks, and you could do like a bundle that comes with like a scarf and a hat. Well, a scarf and a hat. A scarf and earmuffs for the one that I got. I think the other one came with something different. Um, and then you can't put any scents or sounds in there. You have to take it to the actual build bear near you to do that. Which kind of sucks for bundles, but, I mean, I get why, you know? But, um, that at least they still do give you a birth certificate, and, like, um, you can add the little satin card that they give you when you go to the, go to the bear and you make your wish and everything, and put that in there. Um, so, yeah. But, now, since I told you guys about that, I'm gonna open it. Okay, so what do we have? What do we have here? So there's a little letter in here. I'm gonna read it to you guys. So it says, "Brother Workshop, we believe in the timeless comfort of a teddy bear hug. Sharing hugs and stuffing each furry friend with love are our ways of adding a little more love to life." Since 1997, which I was two years old then, millions of furry friends have been made around the world, and our bear brothers have placed a special heart inside them. It's one of ways to experience Build a Bear at Build a Bear, which is Instagram handle, and they give you all the other things. And I have our tale of giving at buildabearfoundation.org. So this is a little letter. It's very cute. Classic Build a Bear, like, artwork up here at the top, you know. And I have my birth certificate for it. They, of course, they didn't put the name. They didn't put the name or anything on here. But normally they let you do it for bundles, but I guess for this one they didn't, you know, do it, but whatever. Um, so yeah. And then, I was wondering, like, it's kind of small, where's the little box they gave you? So, how do you get this out? Oh my god. It's like hiding me. They just, like, shoved it in here. Oh my god. Okay. I can't get it out. Oh, okay. So that's, that's that. So, here we have the little, you know, I'm just gonna, for the sake of the video, you know, do it for the two. 
I'm going to set up a little box here. Or the, as I call it, Cub Condo. So cute. Look at it. It's adorable. I love going to the other and getting these. Oh my god, you don't even understand. <laughs> I love carrying these around. Okay. So, there's a little box. And of course, you can see her on the inside. Um, let's open her up now. Oh, she's precious. She's so little. She's so fluffy. I kind of, I think I want her a little firmer. But she's perfect. I mean, like, she's adorable. Look how cute. The gingerbread lady, woman, girl. <laughs> um, I'm not really sure what to call her, but she's so cute with her little paw. She has a classic go bear paw print on her and everything. She's so soft and adorable. Look how pretty. Look how adorable. When I saw her, I was like, I have to have her. She was six bucks, like I said, so she wasn't expensive at all. I think the whole order came out to $20 because I charged you eight bucks for shipping. They didn't have an option to ship it to the nearest Billy Bear to me. So, um, yeah. But this is the little bear muffs and, um, Scarf set, so it's a whole set. This was four bucks, so whole set would have been ten dollars if it wasn't for shipping and everything, and then taxes. So shipping was like eight bucks. Taxes were two dollars, so extra ten. That's why it was twenty. Um, still not bad though, honestly. Still not bad. I got this, and this was seventy-five cents. Not expensive at all, you know. And I don't think they charge you for the birth certificate either. Um, so yeah, but let me put this on it. Real quick. Mm. Actually, I don't want to work that, so I'm going to cut it. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to take this off her head. I'm keeping her, so. She's so cute. But I hate the fact that this is like stuck in her. Oh, okay. That wasn't that hard at all. I thought it was gonna like stuck in her head. I was gonna have to like force it out or something. She's so cute. How do you put these on? Oh, how adorable. Oh my god. Look how cute. That's the air moss. I'm gonna put the little scarf on her. Tight it all nice. Cozy. She's so cute. Look how adorable this is. Like, oh my god, I can't even. She's so pretty. I love her. Let me put this down because it's kind of in the way. But isn't she adorable, guys? Like, look at her. Look how pretty she is. You guys know I love stuffed animals. I didn't always. I think after my aunt died when I was nine, I just kind of gravitated towards them. So I'm just kind of. It's such animal nut now. I have so many of them, and the ones I have in my room aren't even all of them. Um, there's a couple that reside at my boyfriend's house, or well, fiance's house. I still haven't gotten used to saying that. I should put this all upside down now that I realize it. Because the fluffy stuff is on the outside. Okay. Either way. She still is cute. I mean, even if the scarf is on the wrong side, she still looks cute, so that's all that matters. She's adorable. Oh my gosh, I love her little bow and her cute little cheeks and her little eyelashes. That was gingerbread boy too. Um, but I loved her. When I saw her, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to have her. So, she's perfect. But, yeah, I love her. She's a little smaller than I thought she would be, but she's still pretty, a pretty nice size. She's not too big, not too small. She's perfect. So... Yeah, and she came a day early. She actually came yesterday, and she wasn't supposed to be here until today. Today is Wednesday. So she wasn't supposed to be here until today, but she came here yesterday. She got here yesterday, so. Yeah. She's so cute. Oh, my gosh. She's so cute. I wish I could make her. I wish I could have gotten her stuff to smell like gingerbread or something, but, again, you can't put scents in these when they're bundles now. If, if you want scents, you have to take them to the actual Build-A-Bear 
and like open them up to do that. So she's still so pretty, so perfect. I love her. Absolutely love her. Um anyway, may I pull out this and I'm exhausted, so I'm gonna go and clean up my bed but I made a mess up now. And take a nap, much need a rest, because I have a lot of editing to do for the tonight and into tomorrow morning. So, um, we're going to sign off here. This is the last video for the first half of 2020, so this is day 11 that you guys are seeing now. Um, so excited for us, the 2020s of art. There's going to be a whole bunch, including some gingerbread, um, some gingerbread house making competition between me and Isaiah. Be going down. Joking. <laughs> We're so competitive with each other. It's, it's crazy. It was so fun. Um, he's a really sore loser. I am not. So, um, but there's gonna be that. There's some other things. I'm gonna be making some. I'm gonna be um, making a special holiday edition of my famous. As because a lot of you guys like the other video I did. I'm going to be holidayifying my hot chocolate recipe. So I'm excited to do that. I was going to do it last year, but didn't. Um, I wasn't able to get the ingredients I needed to make it because they weren't, they didn't have them at the store. So this year, hopefully, I'll be able to make that. And there's a couple other things. There's a bunch of other things I, 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 I'm going to be doing. There's a lot of things that I really want to do this year, but given the circumstances, I can't do them. So trying to figure out things to do for the last little bit of that. Um, and then of course you guys will see my birthday celebration, um, my at home birthday celebration and like uh, things like that. So mm, this should be fun. I'm excited. I was actually going to cancel 20 days of art this year, fun fact, because everything is going on and like me being mentally kind of, eh, like a lot of us are. But I was like, you know what, I still want to stay in the holiday spirit and still want to do this for you guys and have fun. A lot of you guys really enjoy watching my videos. So I was like, I can't just like the people. I mean, like, they're the people. So, I mean, I'm still going to do it. I still want to do it. We're still doing it. I mean, obviously, you guys are watching this. I'm, I did it. I'm doing it. So, yeah, we're just going to have some fun, huh, Miss Gingerbread Lady? Whose scarf came down. <laughs> um... But yeah, we're going to sign off here. I love all of you guys so much. Um, it's been a crazy year, but hopefully all these videos and everything bring you guys at least a little bit of joy. I would hope so. Um, I have fun watching. I have fun making them watching. This. I have fun making them. And I hope that you guys fun have fun. Um, I can't even talk anymore. I have fun making them. And I hope that you guys have fun watching them. Like by yourselves or with your family or you know whatever the case is, I just hope you guys enjoy watching them just as much as I had fun making them for you all. So yeah, again, love you guys, and I'll see you in episode twelve. <laughs> Bye, and uh, peace out.